Linebacker Josh Forrest and Kentucky hosting Auburn. The first Thursday night home game since 1939. Opening drive for Auburn, Peyton Barber runs it in from one yard out on the 12th play, 7-0. Ensuing Kentucky drive, the pitch to Boom Williams. Looks like he might be stopped, but he finds a crease and he runs it all the way down to the Auburn three-yard line, a 60-yard gain. That leads to a touchdown. We're tied at seven. Trading touchdown for touchdown. The Tigers strike on their next drive. Karen Johnson, the six-yard run. Tigers led 23-10 at the half. Second half we go. Williams on the handoff. Just does get it across the goal line. Six-yard score. Kentucky cuts the lead to 23-17. Five minutes left in the game. Tolls looking, throwing deep, and look at the catch made by Jeff Bidette. Sets up the Cats inside the five. Mikhail Horton would punch it in to make the score 30-27. Facing a fourth and three, down three with 33 seconds remaining. Tolls is pressured and dropped for a loss. And that, heartbreakingly, is how the game ends. Auburn 30, Kentucky 27. A tough loss for what was an excited crowd. Our own Jamie McCracken is in Lexington. He now joins us with more from outside Commonwealth Stadium. Jamie, a lot of hype. But tough way to lose if you're a Kentucky fan, coach, or player. Yeah, there's no doubt about that, Josh. They had a chance at the end of the game. Again, like you said, it was a fourth and three, but they could not convert that. Here's a happy head coach, Mark Soups, but also sad. He was happy about the environment, but sad, of course, about the loss. So close. We just could never get that momentum and get on top. And, and uh, you know, that's, that's probably – you know what's going to bother you is you know we've had opportunities to get the game tied or get you know get ahead and just couldn't do it and uh, couldn't get the fans really juiced up and really into it but I mean they were but uh, but uh, we could have really you know done our part so uh, but really appreciate the atmosphere and the effort it was it was fantastic uh, environment Well, next up for the football cats is Mississippi State. They'll go to Starkville next Saturday night, 730 kickoff in the SEC network. The last time Kentucky defeated Mississippi State was in 2008 in Starkville. So we'll see what happens there again. The football cats to fall to four and two tonight after a loss to Auburn 30 to 27. Reporting live in Lexington, Jamie McCracken, WYMT Mountain Sports, Josh.